Find a cure, find a cure for my life, find a cure, find a cure for my life, find a cure, find a cure for my life, find a cure, find a cure for my life, oh my god, oh you think I'm in control, oh my god, oh you think it's all for fun, oh my god, oh you think I'm in control, oh my god, oh you think it's all for fun, gonna smile, gonna smile on my face. Hey guys, and welcome to my review of Season of the Witch. Now this review is a little bit late, because, well, really late, because I saw this movie on Friday night, the day it was released, and, you know, I haven't made a review in today's Monday night at, like, 9 o'clock where I am, so. Anyways, um, Season of the Witch stars Nicolas Cage and Ron Perlman, a.k.a. Hellboy. Love Hellboy. It's a great movie. It's a terrible PS3 game. That game is not very good. Just kidding, I kind of like it. It's not bad, but that's off the subject. Season of the Witch is basically about Nicolas Cage, Ron Perlman, and their crew are basically trying to transport a girl who is believed to be a witch, but you don't know if she's a witch or not, to some church or something, I forget, really. Mm hmm. And I'm not going to spoil anything, since near the end it does get pretty insane and pretty crazy. And... Wow. It was pretty insane, but... You know, a lot of people are hating on this movie right now, and I can see why, I guess, but I enjoyed it. I enjoyed it. I mean, the action sequences were quite exhilarating to me. Nah, I wouldn't say exhilarating, but pretty entertaining and a little bit exciting. Um, the ending sequence was very exciting, and the bridge sequence. Um, yeah, it's really about it. Um... I don't really have much to say about this movie. Oh yeah, the special effects a lot of people are saying are terrible. I thought they looked good. I mean, the dogs, the wolves or whatever, when they like transform, that looked pretty cool. I mean, the ending looked just okay, but, you know. I have a big headache right now, I'm sorry. But, you know, I wouldn't say go see it in the theater, because it's not really worth, like, full admission price and everything, but I'd say when it comes on DVD, probably buy it or rent it, because it's not bad, and it's definitely worth a watch if you are into the same type of movies I am, but, uh, yeah, um, thank you for watching this review, I'd probably give Season of the Witch a 3, no, a 4 out of 5, and thank you for watching this review, and I will see you guys next time, goodbye.